That desperate search for the relative of a TV star and top NFL quarterback, Michael Cavallari's car was found abandoned by the side of a road in Utah the day after Thanksgiving. ABC's Kena Whitworth has the latest, joins us this morning from Los Angeles. Good morning, Kena. Robin, good morning to you. So this is very concerning. He lives here in California, but his car was found more than 700 miles away in Grand County, Utah. This morning, authorities in Utah searching for Michael Cavallari, the 30-year-old brother of reality TV star Kristen Cavallari. This is where police say they found his car the day after Thanksgiving after a passerby spotted it about 100 feet from the road in a remote area of Grand County, Utah. His laptop and cell phone abandoned inside. The car was still running and the driver's side airbag deployed. The temperatures on the night of the incident were in the mid to low 20s. Very, very hostile conditions for somebody that was not properly equipped to be here. Could be fatal. Credit card receipts led authorities to this convenience store in Monticello, about 100 miles from where his car was found. Cavallari, last seen on the security cameras, wearing a green sweatshirt and blue baseball cap as he pumped gas. There's been ground teams out in this area covering probably a 15 square mile area. Cavallari's husband, Jay Cutler, the quarterback for the Chicago Bears, was asked about his brother-in-law's disappearance following his team's tough loss Sunday. Jay, has it been a tough week? Has it been hard to kind of get into game mindset for this week? With the stuff going on that we've heard about lately with your wife's brother. And stuff. Oh, no. Um, I mean, we stay focused. Kristen Cavallari rose to fame on the teen reality show Laguna Beach, the brother and sister seen here in this high school photo. Cavallari, a former Dancing with the Stars contestant, just gave birth to her third child with Cutler. She posted this photo of her baby girl on Instagram, but has yet to make any public comment on her brother's disappearance. This investigation is ongoing. They are treating it as a missing persons case. Also, police telling us that later this week they're going to be bringing in dogs and perhaps unmanned aircraft to help with this search. Robin mm. and George. Wow, I hope they get some clues mm -hmm. real fast.